for more videos on people's struggles, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Lebanese students protested and met with riot police and army repression in Beirut. On Saturday, students of the American University of Beirut, or AUB, staged a day of rage outside the university gate against the dollarization of tuition fees. The riot police and the army used tear gas and brutally beat up the students who were peacefully protesting. A report by the local media, Al Jadid, says one student met with severe injuries and Al Jazeera reports one student being arrested. Earlier this month, the president of the American University of Beirut, Faldo Khouri, announced that the university has been under financial strain and will be adopting the central bank's semi-official exchange rate, which is LBP 3,900 per dollar instead of LBP 1,515. Following the footsteps of AUB, which is the American University of Beirut, the Lebanese American University also issued a statement saying that they too will be adopting the LBP 3900 rate. In an email, LAU's president Mikhail Mawad wrote that the university has been severely impacted by the economic collapse and leaving the administration with no other option but to adjust the rate of tuition fees. A political university. 800 employees were laid off without any prior notice from the American University of Beirut and its affiliated AUB Medical Center in the month of July. 500 doctors and 400 nurses from AUBMC have submitted their immigration applications in the past four months. AUB Medical Center also opted to hike the prices of some of its medical services in line with the LBP 3900. These universities are the oldest universities in the country with the largest endowment of any university in Lebanon at $769 million at the end of 2019. 250 of 9,400 students at the AUB have dropped out from the studies, while 600 incoming students have decided not to continue. According to various media reports, out of 1,200 professors, 200 professors at AUB have submitted their resignations. Responding to the students' agitation, Khouri made the proposal to the students. He wrote, the measures we are taking mean that with the support of our board, alumni and friends, we plan to increase the financial aid budget by more than $20 million in the coming spring term, compared with the fall. This will allow us to assist more than 60% of our most deserving undergraduate students. Making a statement on social media on the behalf of all the clubs at the university, the AUB Secular Club made clear that the administration's proposal was not enough and they outrightly rejected the university plan. Students from across Lebanon and public universities extended their solidarity towards AUB and LAU students. The dollarization of Lebanon's top private universities is a concern for students at the country's public universities like the Lebanese University. Lebanon is struggling with the worst economic crisis since 1957 to 1990. Over the past year, the Lebanese pound has lost up to 80% of its value on the black market. The country's deep financial crisis was compounded by COVID-19 and the aftermath of the massive Beirut port blast in August which wrecked large parts of the city, killing 200 people and injuring more than 6,000. Yeah,